Hi guys, welcome sa Zipline. So, tuloy yung ating uh, practice exercises on uh, chain rule, no? So, in this video, I I think this is uh, practice exercise number 5, no? If I'm not mistaken. Anyway, it doesn't matter. So, uh, g of x is equal to 1 over 4x cubed plus 1 quantity squared. So, again, um... So, chain rule na pag natin that if you have a function raised to a particular power, ginagawa natin, binababa natin yung kanyang power, no? yung kanyang exponent, kaya siya naging n, tapos i-multiply natin doon sa function, and then babawasan natin yung power niya ng 1. No? And then we get the derivative of the function. No? So, dapat ma-memorize niya yung, uh, ano na yan, yung uh, proseso na yan no? para madali niyo masolve. So uh, dito since naka ano tayo naka divide mas maganda kung uh, magawa natin ng paraan para in the form of f of x raised to the n siya. Ibig sabihin wala siyang denominator, wala siya sa denominator. And we can do this by uh, negative exponent, di ba? So magiging 4x plus 1 raised to the negative 2. Okay? So okay na yan. Meaning, uh, g prime of x, no? g prime of x is equal to, ibababa natin tong exponent, so negative 2, di ba? Inaba natin dito. Tapos, we, are, we multiply it by the function itself. So, 4x cubed, 4x cubed plus 1. And then, magsasubtract tayo ng 1 dun sa exponent. So, negative 2 minus 1. This is negative 3. Okay, so palaging marami nagkakamali dyan na Akala po nila, pag negative 2 naging negative 1 na. So, ang negative 2 minus 1 ay negative 3. So, very, very, ano yan, basic, pero madami nagkakamali dyan. And then times, we get the derivative of 4x cubed. ddx of 4x cubed plus 1. So, we get the derivative. So, this becomes negative 2 times 4x cubed plus 1 raised to the negative 3. Ano ang 4x cubed plus 1? Ano ang derivative niya? 12x squared. No? So, baba natin to, tapos babawasan natin ang 3 ng 1. So, 3 times 4 kaya siya naging 12. Medyo hindi ko na dinidetali kasi ang dami na natin na solve before. No? So, ang expected ko is alam nyo na to. Alam nyo na yung power pool. So, pwede natin isimplify ito tsaka ito kasi madali lang naman siya. So, i-multiply natin yan. That's multiplication, di ba? So, negative 24x cubed. Sorry. Negative 24x squared times 4x cubed plus 1 to the negative 3. Ngayon, pag tapos na, simplify na natin. Babalik na natin yung negative exponent. Magiging positive exponent ulit siya. So, magiging negative 24x cubed times 1 over 4x cubed plus 1 cubed. No? So, ibig sabihin, over 1 din to. Pag minultiply natin yan, magiging negative. Negative times positive is negative. 24x cubed over 4x cubed plus 1 quantity cubed. So, ito na yung ating g prime of x. So, yung ating derivative. 